topics which we're going to cover in this video. But before we do that, I want to draw your attention to an email you should have received. It looks like this. This email is very important because it contains your login name and your organization administrator's name. We often call that person the org admin. When you receive this email, you'll be prompted to confirm your user details. This is where you enter your Aconex password for the first time. It's a good idea to keep a copy of this somewhere safe so that you can refer to it later. So if you need to, pause the video, go find the email and your password and put it somewhere safe. If you don't have these pieces of information, we'll tell you how you can recover them later in this video. Okay, so now that's all taken care of, let's take a look at how we log in to Aconex. Firstly, go to Support Central and click the Login button at the top of the page. Select your project location. This is also referred to as your Aconex instance. If you're going to be using the same project location every time, go ahead and check Remember My Selection and then click Go. Under the Aconex logo, you'll see the project location you just selected. Now, remember that email we mentioned earlier. Refer to that now and go ahead and enter your login name and password then click the login button. And that's it. Pretty straightforward. But what if you've misplaced your login email, forgotten your login, or entered the incorrect password? Login names and passwords are case sensitive, so first of all, check your spelling and make sure your caps lock is not on. If you've tried to log in a couple of times without success or you've just forgotten, it's probably easiest just to reset your password. To do this, click the link underneath the login button. If you remember your login name, use that. If not, Try your email address and click Go. In a few moments, you'll get an email from Aconex with a link to reset your password. Follow the link, enter, and confirm your new password. <laughs> but what if you can't remember your login name, or the email address used to register you on the project is not the same as your company email address? Here's where things can get a bit tricky. You would have been invited to the project by your organization administrator. They are the only people who can resend or reset this information for you. That's why we recommend the first time you log into Aconex, you click the help link. This opens up a window and displays a list of the org admins. Make a note of these names for future reference. If you still don't know who your org admin is, give us a call and we can tell you. It's a bit of a process, but it's one of the ways we keep Aconex secure. If you're working on multiple projects or have multiple Aconex accounts, Global Login makes logging in much easier. To log in via Global Login, click the link at the bottom of the login screen. This will take you to the Global Login sign-in page. If this is your first time, you'll need to go through a few steps to set up your Global Login ID. Fill in the information on this form. The email address you enter at this step will become your Global Login ID. This can be any email address that you own and it's not necessarily your company email address. Once you've confirmed your email, you can start using Global Login and begin linking your accounts. So, to recap, make sure you keep the email with your login information in a safe place and take a note of your org admin's names. If you forget your password and know what your login name is, you can reset your own password from the login screen. If you forget your login name and email address, you'll need to ask your org admin to reset it for you. If you don't know who your org admin is, you'll have to contact Aconex. If you have multiple accounts in Aconex, be sure to set up a global login ID. It will save you time. For more information on how to log into Aconex, visit the Login Help section of Support Central for detailed step-by-step -step articles. So that was a lot of information, but keeping your user details secure is really important. So let's move on and take a look at Aconex.